up Woody Nerdigans, this is the one and only Packer Girl 89 and today's manga Nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for Jibaku Shonen Hanoko Kun aka Toilet Bound Hanoko Kun chapter 71 and oh my god I'm still shook from last chapter because last chapter confirmed AOI is dead the moment she fell into that pit she died but what made it even more heartbreaking was when Akane and AOI were walking up the stairs and Akane turned back she was gone that was so heartbreaking and then Hanako said something interesting he said that with AOI gone that Nini's life is going to be extended but he's not going to be seeing her much longer. So this is going to be interesting to find out what he means by that. D does this mean that Nini is not going to be able to see him anymore because her life is extended? And that maybe the only reason she could see Hinoko was because she was close to dying. That'll be interesting to find out. Let's get to this chapter and see what's in store for us this month. And this cover page is gorge, 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 gorge. But look at the look at the light bulbs and look at them breaking with the numbers on it. I wonder if it symbolizes um, how close to each number, you know, each num uh, mystery is close to dying. And this chapter, um is titled uh, Severance. Oh shit. Unknown by everyone. Untold to anyone. Akane was looking for AOI. Oh god. I, I'm gonna totally cry. This is so so heartbreaking. Ayo-chan, where are you? Ayo-chan? Ayo-chan! President, Ayo-chan's not here. We've gotta search for her quickly. President? What are you doing? Akane... Akane-san isn't here. Since she wasn't in a state where she could have returned. Oh, God. From the moment she stepped foot in that place, Akane-san was no longer one of the living. Huh? No longer one of the living? What, what are you saying? The, to say Ayo-chan can't return, you must be kidding. Did you know this already from the start? More or less, yes. You bastard! Oh, God! I'm sorry, I cannot blame him for punching him. But at the same time, I understand why he didn't tell him right away. I do, because he wanted him, he wanted Akane to spend as much uh, time with um, AOI as he could. And to get that closure that both him and AOI needed so that way she could pass on. Otherwise, let's be real, AOI was not going to be able to pass on unless she got that closure. What, uh, why, why didn't you, why didn't you say anything? Even if I told you, it wouldn't have done any good. Are you done yet? He's right about that, too. I've had enough. What are you going to do? Um, isn't it obvious? I'm going back to where Aochan is. I'm sure I can still make it on time. Aoi, it's no use. Let go. As if I could leave her alone in a place like that. Um, Akane, it's, it's, you're, it's too late. I have to hurry. What are you doing? Just what do you think you can do with that dying body? Besides, the passage we used to return here is already closed. Going back there is impossible. Shut, shut up. Why? Why did you only bring me back? I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try and make it through this. 
ally. Stay right there. Oh, I'm sorry. Anyway, stay right there. Come on. I understand. I understand. Anyway, wouldn't want Akai to come back just yet. No. Aoi would want Akane to live on. And when the time is right, they'll be reunited. They will. Two, that was bomb. What? That supernatural just... President? Wait, what was that? Get up, AOI. We need to treat that injury quickly. Just, um, let's go meet the clock keepers. It seems we're out of time. <gasps> what? One, two, three, four, five supernaturals. And they're shattering. Ah, there you are. Hey, Yashiro. Jeez, um, Hanoko kind of just left all of a sudden. Sumire Chan and I were looking for you, you know. Let's go, Hanoka Kun. We still have to find number six and save Aoi. Is something wrong? Hmm. Oh, I'm just thinking that it's about time. What do you mean about time? The bell? But why? It's the middle of the night. Hey, Hanoka Kun, is something about to start? It's the severance. Why is he mean? Ah? Uh? No! Anoko-kun? What's wrong with your body? It's it's breaking apart? Now that a girl has been offered up as a sacrifice, the human and supernatural worlds will be completely separated from now on. Uh, what are you talking about? We supernaturals will disappear from this place. <gasps> what? But all of this no longer has anything to do with you, Yashiro, because you'll soon forget all your memories connected to supernaturals. Nokokan and everything about me and Aoi Chan too and live happily on. What are you saying? Hey! Stop stop it! Is that from her? Such unnecessary trouble. Nokokan, what were you about to do to me? What do you mean by forgetting? And about AOI too? You're always like this, Hanoko kun Never saying a word to anyone, deciding things all by yourself? What are you trying to do this time? And what's happening now? Explain everything properly. Your wish has been fulfilled, Yashiro. My wish? Didn't you make a wish to me? That you want to live longer in the real world? Though I don't know if it extended enough uh, to get you to a hundred years old. My lifespan has been extended? It has. Are you unhappy? Mm, not at all, but is that true? And why so suddenly? Because Aoi Chan has died in your stead. Eh? W what are you saying, Anoko Kun? I mean, my lifespan has nothing to do with Aoi at all. And you even said it yourself, Anoko Kun, that we would go and uh, save Aoi together afterwards. Hey, is this is a lie, right? No way, I mean, I... What I said back then, I... I didn't wish for any of this. I... What can I say? You gotta be careful what you wish for. I... What I said back then was about wanting to live in a world with both AOI and Hanoko Kun. And at the same world I had been living in until now. That's what I meant. AOI can't die in my stead. I don't want that. I thought as much. But Yashiro, I like you more than AOI Chan, you see. I'm sorry, but it's okay. I'm going to disappear soon. So even if it's not right now. You'll still forget someday. Don't go. 
Try living with you too, Yashiro. What? Why? Oh my god. Oh my god. Is this really good? Are. Is this manga really gonna end like this? No, this manga isn't complete. This manga isn't en over yet. No. There is something though. Cuz I want to go back to what the president said. About um the uh the timekeepers. I think that's where they're going. The clock keepers. They're going with the they're going to the clock keepers right now. So what are they gonna do at the clock keepers? I think they're gonna rewrite do I think they're gonna rewrite what happened? Possibly. I think they are. And it makes me wonder if the sacrifice was ultimately going to be Yashiro. I really believe it. I believe Yashiro was going to be the sacrifice. I straight up do. That's probably why her lifespan was shortened. Because she was going to be the sacrifice. But what about the clock keepers? So what do you think the clock keepers are going to do? Because... Of because look at the president's reaction to the supernaturals. I think... I think the president... If, if I remember correctly... What the, what's going to happen with the clock keepers, what AOI is going to do... Is he's going to turn back time. And make it so... AOI... Do I think it's going to be to the point where AOI doesn't go into the pit? Possibly. That might be it. I'm very curious what you guys think. Do you guys think that this that's going to be the case where they go back enough in time to where AOI doesn't fall, where AOI and them don't fall into the pit? That's got to be it. That's the only thing I can think of as to where they don't, it has to be a situation where they don't fall into the pit. But the question is why? Well, because little bro is, because little bro fell into the pit. President wants to save his brother. That's why. That's why he is allowing this. That's why he, he's, um, ha that's what, that's why he saved AOI. That makes sense. He saved AOI because he wants to save his brother. Because remember, his brother fell into the, the pit too. And by that logic, he would be dead. So that everything makes, that makes complete sense. So that's what's going to happen. They're going to go to the clock keepers. They're going to turn back time uh, probably before the underworld before falling into the pit obviously but will it be before AOI met number six to make that deal us uh, that might be in a you know what it could be that to where um to where AO convinces AOI to not do it to not go um, make the deal with number six. That might be it. I'm really curious what you guys think. Do you guys think that's the case where a where um, AO um, uh, where AOI makes and goes back in time long um, 
far back enough in time where uh, he stops Ao from making the deal with number six. That to me would make the most sense. It would. Or do you think it's gonna go back even further in regards to the wish? I, but the only thing I'm very curious about in this case with um, the clock keepers, do you think that um, they're gonna make it so it will be where only him uh, where the president, Nini, and um, obvious, obviously AOI is going to remember. But um, AOI, Nini, and the president retain their memories. That to me would make the most sense. And plus, remember, Nini's got uh, that bracelet on. And that bracelet protects her. So I wonder if that's going to be the case. Let me know your thoughts in the comments section below. And remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdy Games Inc. If you love what I'm doing and want to help keep this channel alive so I can keep bringing you more Hinoko con uh, content, there's a few ways you can do that. You can donate to my Cash App, PayPal, Patreon, purchase something on my Amazon wish list. All that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow me on Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, from me on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below as well. Till next time, Nerdigans, I will be seeing you later.